Hoffman, we do begin with breaking news. Multiple lanes of I-70 are closed right now after a semi crash causing some massive traffic backups. This is video our news crew shot from the ground. This crash is off of Van Brunt and right now we're working to get more details about exactly what happened there. KMBC 9's Matt Evans is joining us live with the latest from there. So Matt, what do we know so far? Well, what we know is this uh, semi crashed earlier this morning, uh, causing quite a big backup on I-70 eastbound. As you mentioned, Kelly, we can show you what happened here. Whenever we took a look from the sky, you could see that the semi had crashed into a barrier over here. Somewhere around this area was in the left lane, and then you can see tire tracks moving it over into the actual uh, road. Here's some video that we shot with our drone that shows you where those tire tracks went. You can see that it kind of cut across a few lanes of traffic and then went up into an embankment here. Uh, good news is nobody seriously injured. Uh, doesn't appear any other vehicles were involved either. And on top of that, it appears that the uh, semi itself isn't that majorly damaged. So they do have some wreckers in here, some heavy machinery, heavy equipment to get it off of that embankment and then uh, tow it or maybe even drive it away from this scene. We also have News Chopper 9 on the scene where you can see just uh, what they're working on right now. They've gotten that semi truck off of the embankment. Looks like it's on the shoulder of the road right now, and they are probably just moments away from either towing it or seeing if it's drivable uh, to move it out of here. But again, no major injuries reported here. Uh, looks like only the semi truck was involved, and it also looks that uh, like this road is going to be open up uh, sometime in the near future. Uh, you can see still one lane getting by right now, causing a big backup out of downtown coming into uh, the eastern side of Kansas City, I-70 East Brown, just past Van Brunt. But again, uh, should probably have this opened up in the next uh, 20, 30 minutes or so uh, based on the work that uh, police and wrecking crews have done here. We're live in Kansas City this afternoon. Matt Evans, KBC 9 News.